Hey guys, Bridger Don here. Today I'm going to be talking about candles that I have been loving at the moment. I bought some candles from The Harmonist. If you guys don't know who The Harmonist is, they are a fragrance house that does candles, they do fragrances, and I've heard about them through other fragrance reviewers, but they mostly talked about their fragrances. So I wanted to try out their candles so I could get an idea of what their other fragrances would be like. I think when fragrance houses offer candles, I think that's the best way to start out. So you can test and see what the fragrances smell like. So I bought four candles from the house and honestly, I enjoyed all of them. Like I would repurchase all of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys my opinions on each one. So I'm gonna start this off with Hypnotizing Fire. This is the vessel that you'll get the candle in. It's very simple and minimalist. And this scent, you guys, is so amazing. Ooh, I burned it all the way down, you guys. All of these candles I burned down completely. Guys, I love the scent of Hypnotizing Fire. It smells so amazing. It has this gourmand essence to it. It almost reminds me of By the Fireplace. Not exactly the same, but similar, more elevated. It has this roasted vibe going on, which I really enjoy with this hint of vanilla and it almost has like a citrusy thing going on. So I'm looking on the website and it does have vanilla. It has benzoin, it has Bulgarian rose, patchouli and pimento berries. Mmm. It does have like a little bit like of a, a spiciness too. I really enjoy the notes of this candle. It smells amazing. The throw on this candle is really good. It fills up the entire room. And the burn time is pretty decent too. I think this is maybe 60 hours. It doesn't mention on the website, but I think average is probably 60 hours. But it's a great candle. I definitely recommend getting Hypnotizing Fire. I'm really wanting to get the actual perfume to this candle because I enjoyed burning this candle so much. So Hypnotizing Fire is definitely a candle that I'd recommend especially for the colder months because it just has that gourmandish vibe really good so next is metal flower this one I enjoyed too I like that contrast of a floral note with a metal note it just creates this interesting balance like this smells really good I actually want the fragrance for this one too I think I want all the fragrances to these candles the metal note in this candle is so interesting it's actually very soothing and calming like the floral in here is so soft. I wonder what kind of floral they use. They don't have it on the website, so I don't even know, but it's a beautiful candle. I think this will be best in the warmer weather, like in the spring and summer months, but you can definitely burn it in the fall and winter. I'm just somebody who likes to do things seasonally. <laughs> But either way it goes, it's a beautiful candle. The throw on this candle is amazing as well. It fills up your entire room. So I definitely recommend if you're somebody who loves floral notes and wants to try it with a twist with a metal note, I recommend this. I think this would be such a beautiful fragrance to wear as well. I would definitely get this one. It's beautiful. All right, candle number three. We're going through this pretty fast. So the third candle is magnetic wood. I really enjoy woody candles, like that is just my thing right now. I really enjoy the aromatic touches to this candle. It gives off this energizing vibe, which I like. Like I feel refreshed when I smell this. It's a beautiful candle. And I think the fragrance to this would be really good too. I think the actual perfume, a lot of men would enjoy it because it has a nice woody base. Then the aromatic notes are really lovely. Ooh, the Harmonist candles, like, I'm pleasantly surprised with them. They have a lot of different candles to offer. I only picked four because I didn't want to go overboard, but they're very beautiful. They do retail for $80 per candle, but I think it's worth it in my opinion. The candles are actually really nice. And then we have the fourth candle, which is in the white jar. This is Velvet Fire. I love this scent. This is another aromatic scent, but this is more aromatic than magnetic wood. This one is primarily aromatic. It's more like lavender. I think there is tobacco in this and maybe clary sage. I'm not too sure with that one, but like there's a lot of herbal notes in here. This is a really calming candle, you guys. If you're somebody who deals with a lot of anxiety or you deal with a lot of stress during your work day, I recommend you buying this candle, putting it in your office, in your bedroom, wherever, because it's so calming and soothing to smell. I really want the perfume to this. <laughs> this is just a lovely candle. I really enjoyed it. I'm actually sad that I finished all these candles, especially this one, because it was so soothing just to burn these after a long stressful day. And this will be nice to burn while taking a bath as well. It's just very soothing and just, 
it puts you in a meditative state so yeah guys i enjoyed these candles they were very lovely i think the burn time on them are really great they're highly fragranced and they were worth the money in my opinion i would definitely repurchase if you guys are looking for a new candle brand to try out definitely try out the harmonists they carry fragrances too if you want to try them out and yeah you guys let me know your opinions if you tried out any of their fragrances i have a couple here myself and yeah that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next one bye